Yeah, I could hear sound like dogs just really upset, you know, at something. Stephen Denzik lives in a neighborhood off Bass Road. He says he's been hearing barking coming from the woods behind his property for about a year, and it didn't sound innocent like his dog Zoe. You know, it's not no, I'm just barking because the mailman's driving down the street or anything. You know, they'd be like they're like they were wanting to get at something. The Bibb County Sheriff's Office says while investigating a complaint about the property on Bass Road, they found dogs with fresh scars and a converted treadmill for dog training. <laughs> They brought the animals here to Megan Bibb Animal Welfare. Right now, those are pretty much all taken up by our legal holds. Tracy Bilu, the shelter director, says they're already over capacity and had to move cages out into the hallway. You know, we try and hold off on euthanizing the adoptable dogs as, as long as possible. Bilu says they're currently holding 50 dogs as evidence in various court cases. The entire shelter is only supposed to hold 80 dogs. Got to have some kind of neighbors within sight difference you think that would say something. Denzik says he's keeping his eyes peeled to make sure what happened next door doesn't happen again and to keep his dog Zoe and Rufus away from danger. In Macon, Abby Casores, 13 WMAZ News.